So is it like on just little like pins that you just kind of poke them with? Pretty much. These are the trees. Uh, hey, don't focus mm -hmm. on me and maybe don't watch me either, yeah, okay? You got it, buddy. I'll All be right. done before you know. Look at the one with the lady. That's why we don't stop. Buy it, yeah, family, do we don't quit. Buy it, yeah, family, do we unstoppable. Buy it, yeah, family, do the impossible. Buy it, yeah, family, do. What am I gonna do when Kenya goes to kindergarten? <laughs> I need you! She is doing wash for me. Good job. Okay, that's some detergent. Put it inside. Throw it in. Throw it in. Okay, now close it. Yeah. And all you have to do is push that start button. This one? Uh -huh. Sorry, PJ. Push it again. Yes, and it started. You did it. Oh, Nico's joining in. Remember, guys, these are my speed queens, and I have been really happy with them so far. They are constantly running, and they're made like in the old days with steel and metal instead of plastic. Okay, come here. Anyway, we're heading to the gym. Xander's going. Come here. Xander's going to the allergist. Can you even hear me? Xander's going to the allergist today so we can maybe figure out the last like allergy attack he had. Here you go. Yeah, the the bottle withdrawal is not going well. <laughs> but we're having a hard time at home and there are some things that I'm just like, all right, we're not gonna do that yet. <laughs> anyway, I'll keep you posted on our day. Pretty crazy busy day today, you guys. I'm on my way right now to head into the junior, the middle school to pick up Xander because he's going to his allergy appointment, which he's a little nervous about. And I just had a job training, you guys. I'm doing a remote job at home. I'll tell you about it in a minute. Okay, I'm just waiting for him to come out. Um, as far as I understand, they like prick you like 20 times on your back and kind of find out what you're allergic to. I don't know if you guys remember, but a few months ago, I don't know if he ate something. I don't know if it was exercise induced. Like, I have no idea what happened, but he was going, <coughs> Mom. And his nose was running and his eyes were pouring out water. And it was an allergic reaction, but I was like, What the crap is happening? And I don't know if you guys knew this. I know the, um, our, Older subscribers know that my brother died from anaphylactic shock from bee stings. I mean, if you've seen the movie My Girl, it was the exact same thing. He he had an, aller an allergic reaction to some bee stings and his throat just shut and he basically suffocated to death. Um, he was seven years old. I was two. I don't even remember him. But So when Xander was going and couldn't breathe, I was like, oh my God and I was in the car like we weren't at home so I just like f drove as fast as I could to the nearest Walgreens pharmacy and bought a bottle I like I was like Jason Bourne when he is injured with his like shotgun or sh his gunshot and his leg was it I can't remember it I love that show though I love all the Bourne Identity series um so when he goes into the drugstore and he's like whipping out the liquor and the and the the gauze for his gunshot that's what I was doing in in the pharmacy it was like grabbing a drink I grabbed a water bottle I grabbed the allergy or Benadryl and I ran up to the front desk and I was like hurry 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 hurry, hurry. and I got back into the car where Xander was like going like breathing through a bag so, to not you know panic um because he was panicking and I was too it was scary so you guys remember that? I filmed some of it, right? I was too scared to get my phone out because I was worried about him. I think maybe did India film it for me? I can't remember. But got the Benadryl down him and barely because he's like, I can't, even, I can't even swallow it. But after about 10 or 15 minutes, it did chill out and his throat um, wasn't as tight and shut. I took him to the doctor anyway and... Um, they suggested an allergist, so here he comes. We'll see how it goes, and then I'll tell you about the hey job guys, later. Uh, so right now I'm going to the allergist, and I'm, I'm really stressed about it, and I don't really want to 
do anything because I've been having strange, peculiar, peculiar allergies that have just been coming randomly. And we don't know why. Like sometimes, um, my like side gets all like weird and hoarse and and it get and it starts really hurting and itching. And sometimes I have breathing attacks like where I can't where my throat swells up and we don't and we have no idea why so we're just going right now and I'm kind of stressed right now um, I have a lot of homework that needs to be done and it's super annoying and I'm not really liking middle school right now because it's stressing me out so much so why is it stressing you out homework mom homework. we got homework and stuff and all kinds of that really annoying and stupid things and the teachers are kind of I mean are really strict sometimes and yeah so even though things are hard right now I just keep trying to focus and say my prayers and read my scriptures and just have faith and don't have fear because faith and fear can't be in the same place at the same time so always have faith in God and he will bless you and help you so that's what I just think of. Okay so this doctor is a freaking rock star. It's Dr. Libby Kelly, um, an allergist and she is a full-on detective. <laughs> she like asked him what he ate when he ate it, which we couldn't remember everything, but she's like, okay, you had Dave's Killer Bread? Okay, so she Googled Dave's Killer Bread and put like sunflower seeds while someone's typing behind her. Sunflower seeds, flax seeds, pumpkin seeds, barley, wheat, rye, and then he'll get tested for all of that. Okay, we had what brand of mayonnaise? Oh, okay, there's soy in that. There's da -da 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 -da, and just wrote it all out. So now he's gonna lay on his tummy. I'm sure some of you guys have done this before and he will get um, like a little sample of 55, was it 55? 55 different bushes, weeds, grasses, trees, animals, um, and then, but it doesn't do food, right? Or some foods, but some of the other food has to be done through a blood test, which he's nervous about, but you can do it, okay? You can do it. So I'm trying to get to the bottom of what went down a few months ago. So is it like on just little, like, pins that you just kind of poke him with? Pretty much. Oh my gosh, look at all that. So is it like barley? I mean... So these are the trees. Oh my god. And I'll give you a copy of everything too. That's amazing. So you've done trees or these bushes? So these ones, so here's our trees. Three grasses, weeds, molds, cat, dog, horse, feather. That's another dog. Dust my egg, milk, wheat, soy. What like is it? What kind of dog? So just there's like a... dog epithelial, which is their oh. skin, which we test for. Yeah. Um, you know when patients have right. dog. Can you feel it, Xander? Yeah. Does it hurt? Yeah. Just like a little poke. You're That's doing good. Like a sharp pencil. Basically. You're doing good. You're doing great, buddy. And we'll just zip through the or through these really quick, okay? Just breathe. Good job. Good job. You're doing awesome. Just breathe. You're doing great. Just breathe. You're doing good. A couple more. Almost there. Two more. I'm gonna go get the other. Yeah. That's my good job, buddy. Okay, we're not waiting. And I'll come back in once that timer goes off and look at everything. Okay. And then we'll kind of see what's positive. Sounds good. Okay, so we wait about 15 minutes to see which one starts swelling. You can already see up here on the left shoulder, he's allergic to some things up here and right here. So we're going to find out what these all are. And then I'm going to help blow on his back. You're doing good, buddy. 
Okay, it's been almost 10 minutes, I think, close to 15. I don't, these are all trees. This is, I think, bushes. That's cat, dog, horse. That's another kind of dog. But everything else looks really good, buddy. It's just up here where it's red and swollen a little bit. So she measures it as, well, most of them are like three, four, five, six, and then mulberry is 30. Because <laughs> she measures it either with her finger just by eyeballing it or with kind of a ruler. Yeah, I just look at it. So how did you measure that one with that? You just... So from one side and then all the way to the top, oh it's at three. Is that millimeters? Or? Mm -hmm. Okay. Got some cream on your back. You still pretty itchy. I feel good, Xander. Finally. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you have a bunch of seasonal allergies. Yeah. I think that dog's okay. Wait, this guy's massive. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. Impressive. Mm. What is that, hydrocortisone? Or? No medicine, it's a little bit stronger. Stronger, yeah. This trainer contains no needle or drug and is for training purposes only. Mm. Do not use trainer during an allergic emergency. It's the safety guard, it says pull if with a not, pull. red lace black end against oh. outer thigh. Then push firmly until you hear a click and hiss sound and hold in place for two seconds. So all you do is press. Two, one, training. Mm. That's it. We're gonna go do blood work now. He just did 55 shot, well not shots, but injections of different weeds and molds and grasses and trees and animals and food on his back and now we're doing a blood draw which is super nervous about just keep breathing and now and we're gonna get to the bottom of it you got this okay i'm gonna turn it this way you gotta put this on your arm just so it doesn't hit you so bad okay this rubber band i'm gonna put on you kind of sucks i'm not gonna lie to you okay Straighten that arm and then just squeeze your fist super tight for me. She's looking for a good vein, Sander. But you can do it. I promise you. Yeah, it'll be over before you know it. And it, what I like to do, just walk, look at all this stuff. The giggle board. Stretch yourself. That's hilarious. And just focus on your breathing. Take deep breaths in and out. Okay, don't focus mm -hmm. on me and maybe don't watch me either. Yeah, okay? You got it, buddy. I'll right. done before you know. Look at the one with the lady and the, the grandpa and grandma with okay, the mask. Little Pope. Good job, bud. Are you okay? That's you the worst part. You've done it You're already. Not shooting, okay? All right. Now Good we just got to hold still for a second while I fill these, okay? You doing all right? Yeah? Doing great. You're doing super good. You have anything going on after this? Are you excited? Like, how many vials do you do? 50? I'm, no. only, I'm only doing eight. It's going to seem like a lot, but I promise it's not as much as it's, it is, like, good, seems buddy. like, okay? It looks like a lot, too, but it's not that no, much. You're doing good. Okay, last one. You're doing it, buddy. Oh. Like your plasma. Oh, okay. Your blood. Oh, that's going to be like a total relief. That feel good? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Just gonna let that fill for a little bit longer. Okay. Okay. A little pinch, and you're gonna hear a click, okay? That part kind of sucks. Good job, bud. You doing okay? Yeah. Maybe. Happy for the edge. You really, really put that on you pretty good today. I'll just rip it the opposite direction. You got to keep on rising, don't you ever give up? Keep climbing, that's not the truth. You're gonna take this off in about 10 to 15 minutes, okay? Alright, you can do it. For being so brave, boy got a blue coconut ice cream cone, got a smile on his face, and blood flow in the arm. Family Jewel!